<laughs> hey, this is Yurika from MC Yurika. Thank you for subscribing or watching my YouTube channel. Um, I've always wanted to make a short introduction video of myself in English and since a lot of Super Sentai um, fans subscribed to my channel this week, thank you so much um, I decided this would be a really good timing and I tend to talk a little too much <laughs> so I'm gonna do my best to be very brief and concrete So I repeat, my name is Yurika um, Call me Yurika or Yurika-san or whatever I don't prefer any nicknames so um, whatever you like um, I'm 100% Japanese and I currently live in Tokyo, Japan. I'm a huge fan of Super Sentai, but I am a freakish, freakish, huge, huge, huge fan of Mirai Sentai Time Ranger. And as you can see on my YouTube channel, most of my videos are about Time Ranger. <laughs> um, I really love all the series of Super Sentai, but like I can't compare other Sentais with Time Ranger. Like it's too special for me. <laughs> I watched it first when it was actually on air. And since then, during the past 20 years, I've watched it like 200 times. <laughs> I'm not exaggerating. I mean, what's the point of exaggerating, right? Like saying I watched this like 200 times is like saying that I'm a freak, right? And I'm like, yeah, and I wouldn't do that on purpose. It's just the fact. <laughs> so I'm saying the fact is I've seen it like 200 times. That means I've seen my favorite episodes more than that. So maybe like 350 times. I don't know. I've never counted. But anyway, um, Time Ranger is very, very special to me. I hope I proved to you that already. <laughs> and so that's why I started to refer to myself on YouTube as um, the Time Ranger Onesan. Um, I always start my videos um, like Domo, MC Yurika no Time Ranger Onesan koto Yurika desu. So Time Ranger Onesan, I guess, would be translated to Time Ranger Lady, but Time Ranger Onesan sounds better somehow. So I prefer Time Ranger Onesan. I don't know why, but that sounds better. The reason that I'm a native English speaker is because I lived in the States since I was six until high school graduation. So that's about. 11, 12 years. I lived there with my family due to my father's job. I lived in a city called El Paso, Texas. So I don't really consider Japan to be my hometown because I didn't really grow up here. But when you're a foreigner, it doesn't really matter how long you live there or how well you speak the language. Like if you look different, you're a foreigner. So I never really thought of El Paso as being my hometown either because I was kind of treated as a foreigner. I mean, I had friends and all, but like you know, it wasn't like a really tragic. I didn't have. A, I don't have a really tragic past or anything. But you know, like people see you as a foreigner, so it's really difficult to think of a place like that to be a hometown. But since I grew up there, I guess it's more of a hometown to me than Japan. Because in Japan now, um, even if I speak the language and look 100% Japanese, um, once you tell someone that um, you grew up in the States, you lived there for more than 10 years, they start seeing you as an alien. <laughs> they think you're a returnee and they think you're a foreigner, gaiji, you know? So I've, I have, I don't have any experience being seen as a person that belongs to a, a certain country. <laughs> I guess that's pretty tragic, but um, I like to refer to myself as an alien, you know, I don't belong anywhere, that's cool, right? So um, I'm alien 0227, the code number is my birthday. <laughs> so that's a little background about me. Anyway, um, although I can speak English, as you can see, uh, most of my videos are in Japanese at the moment. I think my level of Japanese and English is about the same, but to me, the language I want to use really depends on what I want to talk or write about. And when it comes to making these kinds of creative contents about my hobbies and such, I think I find Japanese easier. Especially these contents on YouTube that I'm making are about Super Sentai and Super Sentai is originally in Japanese, right? So it's kind of obvious like making something like analysis or quizzes out of something made in Japanese would be easier to be made in Japanese if I know the language, right? So I think that's why most of my videos are currently in Japanese. And some of the videos that I've made using English are more like targeted towards Japanese people who want to practice 
But near future, I really want to make content in English that are targeted towards non-Japanese speakers as well. Um, I just haven't gotten into it, you know, like I, I started YouTube like three months ago and I've been just working my ass off like, um, you know, like doing like, like coming up with ideas and just making videos and like all. And it's been really hard for me to get into like different things at the same time. I've just been working my ass off making videos. I'm just trying to grow my channel to a decent level before I start like trying out too many things at the same time. So I hope you understand. So meanwhile, maybe my Japanese videos about Time Ranger and Super Sentai can be your Japanese listening practice textbook videos or something. <laughs> but I'm always um, open to new ideas. So if you have any ideas or requests, something you want me to do on YouTube or anything, um, feel free to give me like comments on my videos or messages through Twitter, um, email. Ideas from my fans are most um, helpful and I really, really appreciate it. Thank you. Um, other than that, I love to sing, um, write, and doodle. Um, during college, I majored in art. I used to be an oil paint artist but I haven't made any artworks um, these past few years so I don't think I can consider myself to be an artist right now but I make little sketches and doodles of Super Sentai related characters and scenes and I usually upload them on my Twitter so uh, please follow me on Twitter as well the links to my Instagram and Twitter um, they're in the video description so please check it out I am also a big big fan of the Sailor Moon series and Lupin the Third series I haven't really gotten into them on my YouTube, but I plan to make videos of them soon. So if you're a fan of Sailor Moon or Lupin, my channel might be the channel for you. <laughs> and singing too, like I've been kind of hesitant to um, upload my singing videos, but I plan to post more new future. <laughs> I keep saying new future, but um, you know, it's really difficult for me to think of the sequence, you know, how I'm gonna like, how I'm gonna do things on YouTube. So I guess it'd be really nice if you could just um, kind of tag along with me and see how I grow up <laughs> through YouTube. Um, I wanna do a lot of new things. Um, I wanna grow my channel and become capable of doing much more bigger stuff. So I guess, um, please look forward. <laughs> So that was a brief introduction about myself. I also make videos regarding some health issues that I have, but um, I thought that it'd be better if I talk about that on another occasion in another video. So um, if you're curious or if um, you have like similar health issues, my YouTube channel may be uh, another help for you. I hope, I hope it'd be another help for you. But um, through this video, I just wanted to say how thankful I am to all the subscribers that subscribe to my YouTube channel. Even if you're not so fluent in Japanese, you're like a big Super Sentai fan, Time Ranger fan. I guess you were interested or curious about um, what kind of things I'm doing. So um, I, I just wanted to say a hello and a thank you through this video. Um, if you have other um, Time Ranger, Super Sentai, Sailor Moon, Lupin fans around you, um, I'd be super, super happy if you could um, spread your word out about my channel. And I'll be working really, really hard um, to make fun videos. Um, but I'm gonna be very honest, I think um, most of my videos um, are gonna be in Japanese for a while. So I hope you understand, but enjoy. And uh, I don't know how to... I don't know how to end this video, it's really difficult. I've never made like a kind of casual introduction video. All my videos are kind of like structured, so um, I guess I'll just use this. <laughs>